All right, so I'm here with Adam today in the first episode of Will It Drop? <laughs> and we want to know right now, we have this helicopter right here. We're going to take it in the elevator at the Ren's Den. And I want to know what your thought is about whether when we hit, when we move floors, will it drop or will it stay the same? Okay, so my prediction on this is I think it'll have a little bit of an impact. I think it's going to drop at first, but then it's going to kind of catch up with us and kind of level out. And once it's moving at a constant pace, it's going to stay with us. I'm kind of feeling the same way. I think it's going to drop a little bit because of the gravity. If we're going up. Yeah, because yeah. that's what happens, you know, when you do it, too. You feel mm -hmm. your stomach, yeah. you know, but then it equalizes out. I think out. the momentum is going to come. Yeah, so I think that's going to happen, too. All right, well, we're going to go see. Come with us. Whoa, it's going down. It's going down. <laughs> Like it was gonna go and hit the ceiling. <laughs> All right, I'm back with Adam real quick. So what we saw was actually a pretty interesting thing. It it didn't have a constant effect. It had an effect right at the beginning. Yep. Right. So what's going on when the elevator started going down? Mm -hmm. It had a different relative speed or a different relative motion, I guess. Right. Yep. The helicopter was standing there but the elevator was moving down. The air in the elevator was also moving, yeah. but this helicopter has mo it had momentum because it has mass, right? Exactly. So, but once it was brought to a constant speed, the elevator, the yep. helicopter would regain its... They're both relative speeds evened out exactly. because the air was moving with it. Because exactly. again, the, el the helicopter moved because it's pushing air down. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's okay. cool. Now we know. <laughs> 